Hello, let's try to insert the VG site plan to our Revit site plan. So let's go to Revit, go to insert. If you have a connection with Autodesk Cloud systems, so you can try to link topography from these systems. Uh, in this case, I will show simple version which is supported in earlier versions of Revit, so link CAD. From here I select uh, my topography 2D, uh, I select insert, uh, color, invert or black and white. If you preserve it can give you some problems because uh, AutoCAD screen is black and in most cases Revit screen is white so it's better to use invert or black and white so in my case I use black and white if your units in the AutoCAD is set correct so you can use auto detect but if you should double check because in most cases uh, people make mistakes in, in coordinates and units so please check if you are not sure and if you know what kind of units should be used so you can use them here next part i will choose uh, auto by shared coordinates you can try to other uh, ways to import dvg file uh, all ways are correct but but for coordination it's better to use by shared coordinates Let's import to level 1 at this example. You should import in, in real project to the ground level, which represents your ground earth level of your project. And if you want only to import to correct view, you should check this current view only. So you will not be able to see this CAD drawing inside 3D model and other views. In, in some cases it's a very useful tool. And let's leave correct lines what are slightly off axis. And let's open. So I get some information what some elements was lost, but I can continue. This uh, position is important. You should use align. So you want to align your Revit project to the coordinate, which is in the AutoCAD file. And if these files use different GIS coordinate systems, it will be complicated and you need to adjust it by hand. So in this case, AutoCAD is set to local GIS coordinate systems and AutoCAD and AutoCAD 3D civil programs are working very nice with this GIS coordinate system. Revit sometimes get confused and it's, in, it's not supporting uh, these systems so you need to make some changes by hand so let's close and now my side plan from AutoCAD is inserted in center to center